Harare's Hatfield community is still in shock after the brutal murder of a spa female employee, whose mutilated body was found in a pool of blood this Monday, on Sunday last week. Faith Muzonza spent the day working at a local supermarket, serving the community and unaware of the fate that would befall her on her way home. Days later, the Hatfield community converged for a church service in honor of the family woman, whose mutilated body was found on Monday morning in a pool of blood. To the relatives, the pain of losing a loved one in such a manner is unbearable, it is so painful that my sister is gone. She was a pillar in our family but the way she died is so painful we say rest in peace faith, till we meet, a relative mourned, the community had no kind words for the employer who is allegedly failing to provide transport for workers who knock off late, we are calling for you spa management to provide transport to your workers. Please assist your employees so that we reduce such cases. A mourner said, another added, this is so sad. Why SPA is failing to provide transport or else they employ the people from this community so that no one can travel during the night. Speaking on behalf of SPA management, Edfield Branch Accounts Administrator, Mr. Leslie Muzovotsi said he will take up the issue with the top management. The situation we are having here is unfortunate and we are going to carry the issue to the management and it is very unfortunate that we have lost one of us in such a sad way. SPA Hatfield Branch Accounts Administrator, Mr. Leslie Muzovotsi said, the deceased knocked off at around 7 p.m. heading home to Cranbourne, but she never reached her destination. Muzonza, who is survived by her husband and two children aged 6 and 12, will be buried after post-mortem.